Maguire et al. 2000. Navigation-related structural changes in the hippocampi of taxi drivers. The aim of Maguire's study was to investigate the role of the hippocampus in spatial memory and navigation. The participants in Maguire's study were 16 London taxi drivers who had all acquired the knowledge and been licensed for more than one and a half years. The mean age of the participants was 44 years, with a range between 32 and 62 years. All of the taxi drivers were right-handed and were medically and psychologically healthy. Maguire also used a control group of 16 men who were not taxi drivers within the same age range as the taxi drivers. The participants' brains were scanned using magnetic resonance imaging, or MRI, and two methods were used for the analysis. Method 1 was voxel-based morphometry, or VBM, which compares the density of different areas of the brain. Method 2 was pixel counting, counting the pixels in photographic slices through the hippocampal region of participants' brains. The counting was carried out by one person who was blind to the results of the VBM and the type of participant. The results of the voxel-based morphometry showed that the right and left hippocampi of taxi drivers' brains had significantly increased grey matter compared to the control participants. The pixel counting method showed that there were few differences in specific regions of the hippocampus between taxi drivers and control participants. Control participants' anterior right hippocampi were larger on the right than in taxi drivers, as was the body of the hippocampus. In the taxi drivers, the posterior hippocampus was larger than that of the control participants. These results were also correlated with the amount of time that participants had spent driving taxis. A positive correlation was found between the length of time spent driving taxis and the volume of the right posterior hippocampus. A negative correlation was found between the length of time spent driving taxis and the volume of the anterior hippocampus.